So how can you do this problem in 60 seconds or less? Triangles PQR element are graphed. Triangle PQR has vertices PQ and R. Let me draw this super fast. So we have four, six, five, and seven. So this is P, this is Q, and this is R. Okay. Now triangle element has vertices. These are the vertices. So it's somewhere here. It's somewhere here. So this is M. This is N, and we have another triangle. Now, respectively, where K is a positive constant. If the measure of angle Q is T, so if this is T, what's the measure of angle N? And the answer is C. How was I able to do this problem so fast? I had to absolutely rush. This problem is very time consuming. So tough problems require tough measures. But let me spend more time explaining what is really happening. So. If we are to now normally draw the XY coordinate plane with a little bit more class and beauty. So this is X, this is Y. Now let's graph triangle PQR with these points 4, 5, 4, 7, 6, 5. So this is 4, this is 6, this is 5, and this is 7. So we'll have the coordinate P right there, right? So 4, 4, 5. Uh, then we'll have 4 comma 7, so that's P. 4 comma 7, that's going to be Q, right? So Q, okay. And then that's P. And then 6 comma 5 right there, so that is R. Okay, so we have that, so that's R. So P, Q, R, good. Now, long and behold, angle Q is equal to T, T degrees. All right. What can we say about this angle, uh, about this triangle, P, Q, R? Well, clearly... This side is equal to 2. This side is also equal to 2. Now, this is a right triangle, a right angle. So this side is 2, this side is 2. Hence, angle T is 45 degrees because it's an isosceles right triangle. So angle Q, which is equal to essentially T degrees, is equal to 45 degrees. That we know. Now, what's happening is we have another triangle, LMN. Let me use a different color for that. So LMN. Now, L is same as N, 4, 5. So, you know, this is also L. Okay. Now, for M, it's 4, 7 plus K. So we add the K here, and this is our M. Now, this distance here, therefore, is what? It's 2 plus K, right? So this whole distance is 2 plus K. Now, in order for us to find N, we have to do 6 plus K5, right? So this is here. So this is 6 plus K. This distance is K. By the way, that distance was 7 plus K, so that distance was K. So therefore, this is N. If we are to draw this triangle. Now, this side is also going to be equal to 2 plus K, because this is K, so 2 plus K. So guess what? Triangle element is also an isosceles, right isosceles triangle. Um, therefore, this angle is equal to 45 as well. And this angle is also equal to 45 degrees as well. Now, they are asking us, what's the measure of angle N? Angle N is right there. It's 45 degrees. So angle N is also equal to 45. Now, looking through the multiple choices, while the problem is super complicated, if angle T is, well, we know that angle T is 45, but let's assume we didn't. Um, 90 minus T is equal to 90 minus 45. So it's equal to 45, which is the same thing as angle N. So therefore the answer is C. But if you're going to go through multiple choices, you'll see that they add K for some reason, which makes zero sense. So without drawing any of this stuff, you can just eliminate A, B, and D because chances are the K is a side, it's not an angle, has nothing to do with it. So C has to be the only right answer. That's it.